It's seven o'clock. Here are your news headlines. Good evening. The First Minister has asked people to stay at home as much as possible as she prepares to make an urgent statement to the Scottish Parliament tomorrow on the current coronavirus restrictions. A further 2,464 cases were reported today, which Nicola Sturgeon said was of very serious concern. The government's Education Recovery Group will also meet tomorrow to reconsider the advice on schools. Graham Stewart reports. Lynn Campbell speaking to me a little earlier. Now, Boris Johnson has reiterated his position that a Scottish independence referendum should be a once-in-a-generation vote. Speaking on the BBC's Andrew Marr programme, the Prime Minister said the 41-year gap between the referendums on Europe was a good sort of gap. Nicola Sturgeon wants to see an independent Scotland rejoin the EU. Ref Rollout of the Oxford vaccine starts across the UK tomorrow. The questions remain, however, over the decision to change the second dose of both the Oxford and the Pfizer vaccines and when they should be administered. The BBC's health correspondent Anna Collinson reports. Now, mobile libraries used to be a familiar sight on our roads, but Covid has put a stop to all of that. So how do they restart? Elizabeth Quigley reports. This and that's all from us. Good night.